Rob from Woodsy Summercraft here. Today we're going to be turning a cane from Jurassic Park. I purchased this, which is actually a resin replica of the amber with the mosquito inside of it from the movie Jurassic Park. And this is a Christmas gift for my son Cole, who is a huge Jurassic Park fan. And uh, all I used was a dowel rod. It's a poplar dowel rod from the hardware store, so it couldn't get much easier. Than that. I'll talk to you. I am making the cane from Jurassic Park. It was Mr. Hammond's cane. And on the top of it was a uh, piece of amber with a bug in it. It was a, an, in, an insect. A mosquito, in fact. Anyway, I managed to find one online. It's a fake one, as was the movie prop in the actual movie itself. Um, it's in uh, resin. It's a fake bug in resin. But regardless of that, my son Cole will absolutely love it. So I'm making that for him. He is a huge Jurassic Park fan and he wears Jurassic Park t-shirts all the time. In fact, he's got one on today. So uh, <clears throat> without further ado, we're going to turn this cane into Mr. Hammond's cane from Jurassic Park. Now, the only thing is this is a little bit smaller than I wanted. So I've actually used a slightly larger piece for the top portion that holds the resin piece because that's quite large. It's three inches by inch and a half around. I think it's an egg basically with a flat bottom. So anyway, you'll see that I've already turned that piece and uh, now I'm going to cut this down to uh, three feet long and get that between centers and we'll turn a long spindle which will be the cane from Jurassic Park. That's my mate Steve.
this wood being quite soft as it is, I've got it turned and sanded. I sanded it to 400 grit, dry sanding all the way. And now I'm going to put a CA finish on it. So what I ended up doing was sanding the top piece again and just putting a CA finish on it. Because it's soft wood, it doesn't really take a finish that great. It's really just for a prop purposes. So uh, with slow speed on, we'll get the CA finish applied. It's just like doing a big pen. Very big pen. You don't want to breathe these fumes in either, if you can help it. Stand back from that. Get some dust collection going just to suck the air away. And thanks for watching. I'll leave a couple of photographs at the end so you can check it out. Uh, I really appreciate you guys sticking around and watching. I hope you guys had a good Christmas and have a happy new year. And I'll see you again for the next wood turning project. Take care now. Bye.